to some more conversation here as Babatsune Gbedemosi, a longtime member of the People's Democratic Party who had decamped to the Action Democratic Party, now returns to the PDP. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. It's a pleasure. Lagos has recorded its first case of the coronavirus. Uh, you had that extensive uh, concurrent co uh, press conferences by uh, Buja and Lagos Health Authorities. Uh, what do you make of the situation? Are you confident? I mean... Should Lagosians be confident with what you've heard? I really don't think that it's about confidence at this point. Um, I think any confidence would be misplaced. Okay. Um, I think caution is the watchword now. Everyone should be careful. Um, avoid crowded places. Um, I've not really heard much about our patient zero in terms of, uh, first of all, where he was uh, where he was discovered. Apparently, he reported himself to hospital, mm. and that raises all sorts of questions about where he'd been, how long he'd been in the country, uh, uh, before the symptoms well, we presented. Have details. He arrived on the 25th, fell sick, has been in the hospital, contact okay. tracing have begun. It's, it's, it's the, he was discovered on the 27th, two days after he arrived. Mm. Um, I, I really think that that calls for, uh, that calls for serious caution amongst all members of the public in Lagos and wherever it is uh, he actually works. Um, I want to assume that the uh, Lagos State authorities um, are doing everything they can. We can't say that anybody has matters in hand mm. because we've seen how quickly um, this pandemic has spread around the world uh, and in countries where the health facilities are perhaps um, very much better than ours. Um, we've seen what has happened there. I was a bit worried about the fact that the governor said we had only two test centers in Lagos. A state of 24 million people should have far more than that. Um, at the very minimum, um, I would urge the governor and the uh, state commissioner for health to quickly tool up all of the general hospitals in Lagos State to be able to administer these tests. It's, it doesn't make sense, uh, given the 48-hour period uh, you know, within which uh, the 48 hour period uh, between the time of arrival of patient zero and uh, his discovery, uh, I think that, you know, um, it, it's really necessary to make these tests available to all Lagosians as quickly as possible. Okay. So yeah, two government. hospitals, two test centers doesn't make sense okay. at this uh, stage. I, I, I just uh, will follow that in, in the subsequent bulletins, okay. but I just quickly want to come to you because we have very limited time. Uh, what, what's the reason for moving to the PDP? It's about delivering to Lagosians what they deserve. Lagosians pay heavily for nothing at the end of the day. Uh, we don't have good roads, we don't have water, we don't have good environmental sanitation. Some people argue to you that the roads have been impressive lately. Well, I, I guess people are just used to mediocrity mm. if they say that. Um, if, you, if you visit Abuja, um, just for a few hours and you come back to Lagos, you'll be, you'll be depressed mm. at the state of our roads. Mm. Uh, what they call relatively good roads are still quite rough in terms of the road surface. And that's the reason why a lot of our vehicles don't last very long in Lagos State. So we, we need to fix that. And the, the governor, in my opinion, has missed the opportunity of the last six months or so, the last seven months, to fix the roads in Lagos, giving excuses like it's raining and so on. Okay, so we've had uh, relatively... Uh, uh, dry, dry season, and uh, the rains have started again today. Uh, it, it rained today. Uh, it rained in Oshogbo yesterday. It rained in Lagos today. Um, my prayer is that the rains don't become too severe before the governor wakes up to, you know, address the road construction issues. It's not just the roads. It's the drains as well. I've noticed that a lot of the drains are actually blocked with refuse, and there hasn't been any concerted action to, one, uh, uh, clear the uh, drains of debris I mean, so and to, to, to cover the drains so to, as quickly to, to, to as possible. The dividends of democracy, that's why you went to the PDP shelter. You okay, I'm just democracy. curious to know, is it that you felt that you couldn't achieve this with Action Democratic Party? Yes, because you did, that, you did go there in 2018 the, the, the and then you that, comes back the, to the PDP now. The fact is that Nigeria is a two-party democracy. Whichever way we look at it, you know, um, the PDP ran Nigeria for 16 solid years, did very well. Uh, contrary to, you know, the propaganda that out there, that's out there. And uh, the APC have been, in one form or the other, in different names and different parties and different shapes, 
um, have been the opposition uh, to the PDP. So they've now been in charge for the last five years. And we've witnessed what bad governance is in the last five years with the APC. Not just bad governance, but abuse of power and abuse of democracy. Um, the, our democracy has been distorted. Um, the judiciary is messed up. You know, everything, every index by which you can measure progress um, in, in Nigeria has been degraded. Well, we have about 20 seconds to the break, and some people argue with you that the PDP in Lagos, which you have decamped back to, goes to political hibernation every time after an election. That's not uh, exactly true. Yesterday, Governor, Governor Voyo, uh, Governor McIndy, heading the Reconciliation Committee, came to Lagos for that meeting. But even the uh, aggrieved factions were not there. Mr. Doherty was not in that meeting. So even the PDP well, is not Mr. a viable Doherty, opposition Mr. in Lagos. Mr. Doherty was not scheduled to be at that meeting. I was for at a reconciliation the, meeting? I, I was at the meeting. And the, the, the reconciliation uh, thing is a process. It's not, it's not a one-off thing, you know. So Governor McIndy has met uh, some members of the party. He will also meet other members of the party. Mm -hmm. And uh, in time, we will come to a detent, if you like. Mm -hmm. Well, we have to thank you. That's where we we'll leave it at this time. Thank you yeah. so much. We wish you the best with the new party or thank your you. old party, it's which you've come back party. to. I've just gone back. Gone back. Thank you so much, Mr. Badamosi Alari, for coming on the show.